Hi guys, welcome to Meditate with Jess. Um, it's been a minute since I've recorded a new meditation. Just kind of had a lot going on and just trying to keep all of my recordings super authentic. So if I'm like super, super not feeling it, I try um, not to record just so that doesn't show up. Um, so here we go. New meditation. Um, this one is actually one that um, a very good friend of mine uh, did for our 300 hour training. We're still going through that for yoga teacher training, um, the advanced level one. And so we're still like teaching each other and going through meditations each time we meet virtually. And she did this one, and it's specific to the um, pandemic and everything that's going on right now. So timing, I think, should be good, especially with a lot going on right now. Um, some places are starting to open back up. I know in Texas, phase one starts uh, Friday, May 1st, and so there's a lot of, you know, mixed feelings about if it's right or whatever the thought process might be. So I'm going to put the um, water scene up for you like I normally do, and then I'll um, read you the meditation over that. So here comes that. So the intention of today's um, meditation is to help channel and release any fear or anxiety you have going on right now, specifically anything around um, coronavirus and the pandemic that's happening. Um, this meditation is meant for everyone, women, men, kids, anyone who's feeling any kind of anxiety, worry, or fear. So just go ahead and um, get in a comfortable position. It can be seated on a chair or on the floor. It can be lying down. Just in a position that helps you to fully relax. And we're going to start by closing your eyes and taking a deep breath in. Fill your belly with air and expand it as big as you can. And then when you can't breathe in anymore, exhale all your air out through your nose. Tighten your stomach to take the out breath all the way to the end. Again, breathe in deep. And exhale, let it all out. Now bringing your breath back to its normal rhythm and bring your attention to your body. Feel your chest rise and fall with the motion of your breathing. Feel the cool air on your nose as you breathe in and the warm air on your nose as you breathe out. Feel your shoulders lower and relax. Feel your cheeks soften and your jaw release. Let your tongue fall down from the roof of your mouth. Feel your arms get heavier and sink further into relaxation. Let your stomach soften and relax. And feel your legs get heavy and relax. Feel your body melt deeper into your relaxed position. Breathe out any extra tension or pain that might be lingering within your body. As you sit or lie here, thoughts might start popping up in your mind. Maybe these thoughts look like the headlines 
or images you've been seeing on the news or social media. Perhaps these thoughts look like numbers. The number of cases, the number of deaths, the number of the market impact. Maybe these thoughts are about the impact on you. How it can or is already affecting your life, your health, your business, your kids, your schedule, your event, your family, your community. And maybe these thoughts are heavy with visions of all the worst case scenarios painted bright in your mind. See all of those thoughts inside your head, watching as they swirl around, creating a hurricane of worry, stress, anxiety, and fear. Feel how powerful that hurricane is. Feel the energy it has. Feel the movement, the intensity. All this energy of the hurricane is what you've been carrying around. And it's impacting everything else in your life. Your focus, your sense of safety and health, your regular activities, your work, your connection with others. So look at the hurricane as it swirls loudly in front of you. And then notice that you see something very important. The distinction between the facts and the emotions. The facts are standing still outside the hurricane. And the emotions, the fear, the stress, the worry, the anxiety, are what's causing the motion of the hurricane. And they are completely normal emotions to be feeling right now. So take a deep breath in this moment looking at this hurricane of emotion outside of you. And while you look at it, realize that you are in charge of whether or not you allow its energy in today. You have your life to live today. And although the coronavirus is very real and deserves attention from you, This moment, right now, is when you get to decide whether to invite in the facts that will help you navigate your day, or whether you will invite in the chaos of the hurricane of emotions. And no matter what you decide, it's all okay. It's a practice to control what you can, and to let go of what you can't. As you continue your day, and recognize the emotions when they arise, the worry, the fear, the obsession with updates. Simply honor them, and then place them into this hurricane swirling outside of you. Let it be your container to hold it all, while you get connected to the present moment, to what actually is in your life right now. Let the beauty of what is in your life at this moment pull you into the present moment so you can choose to pay attention to and what you let go of. Now begin to wiggle your fingers and your toes, allowing your relaxed body to awaken. Feel your body rise and fall with your breath. And breathe in gratitude for this moment. Trusting that you will have everything you need to deal with the facts as they involve. And in this space of peace, say a silent prayer of compassion, love, and healing for all those whose lives have been directly impacted. Imagine the healing spreading all over the globe as you root yourself in love.
So just taking a moment here, letting all of that sink in. Taking another full body scan. Just see how you feel after that. See what you could soak in, what you could let go of. And just again, breathing in the gratitude for the moment you have right now. And with your eyes closed down, if you're not in a seated uh, position already, go ahead and come up to a seated position. Just let your arms hang down by your side. Shrugging the shoulders up. And with an exhale, relaxing, rolling them down. Again, inhale, shrugging your shoulders up. Exhale, releasing them down. One more time. Inhale, shrug up. And with an exhale, release. Releasing any tension that may be left over. I'm just trying to draw some circles with your neck in one direction. Just nice and gentle. Only as far as what feels good. And then switching and reversing in the other direction. And when you're about even, coming back into center, go ahead and bring your arms up and uh, rolling out your wrists, rolling them in one direction and rolling them in the other. Just kind of adding in some gentle movement. And just bringing your palms down to your lap to rest one final minute. And when you're ready, we're going to just sweep your arms up, take a nice big breath all the way up. And closing those hands down at heart center. Maybe saying any final peaceful thoughts inside your head. Or as we do in uh, yoga, we bow and say namaste. Thank you guys so much for joining me um, for that meditation today. Um, I know it was a little different. Um, I try not to dwell too much on the pandemic and everything that's... Um, going on right now and but you know it is important to find tools to help us to deal with what is going on you know you can avoid it but also if you can try and do things that will help release some of that anxiety and fear around it then it's worth a shot so thank you so much for joining me today and I look forward to seeing you soon have a great day bye guys